I'm going to introduce you to something now and take you on a journey with me. Uh, and it's something that I've been planning on for quite a while. I've been putting money aside, theoretically, uh, not quite saving up, but it's something that uh, I've had on my wanted list and I've finally uh, taken a big risk, taken the plunge, but in a very risky way. And so you're going to see the uh, result of that risk. And it's something that's going to save me uh, time filing if I want to make a, a groove in a block of plastic or uh, cut something out of sheet metal uh, or shape some angle iron into an angle uh, aluminium. I made a little chassis for a little knocked up steam engine. Uh, I'm not about to build a scale model traction engine or anything like that. It's just little bits and pieces that I might to do. And in that sense, it's maybe rather a lot to pay for something that's going to save me a little bit of time doing some filing. It might, hopefully, enable me to do slightly better work. So, here we go. Starting with the unboxing and then going on to something of a review uh, which hopefully will help you make decisions yourself as to whether you're going to take the same risk that I did. Oh, camera's working. Here's a box. I'll put, it, put it on some things from China. Didn't tell much on the outside of the box. Just move it around a bit. Muntasat from 4PX. To me, that's the delivery one. It says one of one on there. Okay. Let's see what happens with this. Right, that's the uh, top prized open. Uh, some polystyrene on the top. It's uh, been bounced about a bit. It's uh, bumped into the edges of the polystyrene, isn't it there? And then uh, I'm just broken up bits of polystyrene down the side. I don't know if they were meant to be over something or not. And then inside the box, something wrapped in, um, and it's free. It doesn't appear to be screwed down to the base at all, including all these bits loose. Right, I'm going to have to see if I can get it out. One thing that was stuck down the side in a bit of bubble wrap is a movable spanner. There we go. That's one bit's included. And I've uh, pulled this off. What you can see there looks like the underside, the bearing end of the um, uh, shaft uh, and there's the dovetail bit that would fit onto the back. I think this is the bottom then of the mill, the underside of the mill itself. Uh, that's the spindle, yes the spindle should I say in there. Out of the box now I just managed to lift that out is the head of the mill. What else is left in the box? A toolbox toolkit, just a little toolkit there, which seems to have lots of uh, other bits and pieces in it, including the jib strip. Uh, we'll have a look at that in a minute, because I haven't finished emptying the box yet. Uh, and polystyrene, the uh, safety guard, and that's a broken bit of polystyrene, that's all that's left in the box. Let's uh, have a look what they've put into the toolbox then. We've already seen a spanner, jib strip, uh, washer for providing the spring tension against the column. Are we on? Yep, yeah. so what came in the toolbox then is the MT3 uh, taper. Uh, device for holding chucks etc which goes up 
inside the spindle, a draw bar which will fit onto that uh, to hold it tight up there, some allen keys, uh, some small nuts and washers, I'm not sure what those are but we've got some a couple of just two T nuts there, one, two, three handles, uh, I said the draw bar and that's the table. total weight is 62 kilograms. This weighs uh, 20, 22 and a half. Oh, the other bit must weigh 40. <laughs> so there's something else to come by DHL then. And that, by the picture on the box, looks like it's a chuck. And a jib strip. Well, let's see. Oof. There we go, an empty box because we've had to open this outside. Two pieces in it, this piece and that piece, which together in the box weighed about 50 kilograms. So let's see what's in this bit. And there we go. Oh yes. Well, looks like a meaty something or other, doesn't it? Mm. Yep. Yeah. Oh dear, that looks like a crappy bit of uh, something applied as an afterthought. But anyway, we'll see. Let's have a look at the other one. 